The first uh, extinct species back is the dire wolf. In plain English, how did you guys do that? We have to find ancient DNA. So you've got all these skulls, but only one tooth from this one cave ever produced any viable DNA. So we went back and got that tooth. We also discovered another skull, extract that DNA, you run it through these sequencing machines and it gives you those letters, right? But the problem is ancient DNA is very fragmented. So you gotta do lots of sampling and it's destructive sampling, so you gotta be careful with these old specimens. And then you can start looking at uh, what its closest living relatives is, and then you have to do the exact same thing. And then you start to compare it all. So a, a dire wolf is 99.5% a gray wolf. And so once you identify those things, you use a suite of different tools, go in and edit the existing donor DNA. In this case, it's the gray wolf. You make those edits. Then we use a process called somatic cell nuclear transfer, where you take the nucleus that's been out of this edited cell, put it in the nucleus of an egg cell, and then we put it actually in a large domestic dog, because dogs are roughly, are, are basically wolves, right? And so um, a, a pug is basically a wolf, which is weird. And and then, you know, 60 days later, we, we gave birth to our first little puppies.